Hey cuties! So today I am going to be doing a perfume and body spray and lotion collection and setup and storage. I've been asked a lot to do one. I've done one or two of these in the past and now it's a little bit different. I've condensed it. I used to have like hundreds of perfumes and body sprays and now I have it condensed into things that I use a lot, things that I love and I try to use them up before buying any others but I just got the Ariana one in my peel box haul just right now like literally 10 minutes ago and I am so excited this is like oh it smells amazing and it is day one of pink sember so i wanted to come in with a bang and do one of your guys most requested videos so here you go i hope you guys enjoyed it and stay gorgeous that was a straight copy of Gigi, and i didn't even mean to do that so yeah, stay gorgeous like i love it <laughs> bye guys here is my little collection here right beside my bedside table i just have it tucked away in the corner this shelf i got at yisk i used to have two of these in my other room and they were completely filled i gave away obviously you guys can see like about half of my collection there's still a lot here but now i have it separated each little individual tier is different so we have perfumes which i've condensed so much lotions and body sprays so i'm going to go with my two perfumes right here here that are matching. It's like a little mommy and a baby. These are one of my fave perfumes. They're Pink Friday by Nicki Minaj. Pull her whole head off here and that's the perfume. It smells very candy-like and girly. You'll see a theme because that's like all I like is candy. So this here is my all-time favorite perfume, Victor Rolf Bon Bon and it's the best perfume of all time and it smells like oh, like luxurious candy. This reminds me of like vampires. I don't know why like this little pressed thing. I feel like they did that. So I'm I'm gonna keep saying my favorite because all the ones at the front here are my favorite. This one here, Forever Red Vanilla Rum. Um, there's just the original Forever Red. This is from Bath and Body Work. Kind of smells like the Victor Rolf Bon Bon, but a little more vanilla-y. My newest addition right here is the Ariana Grande Sweet Like Candy Perfume. Girly. Similar to Pink Friday, but it has its own spin on it. Like all these have such a different scent, but similar. This one is BB Wishes and Dreams. It's a nice gold packaging lady gaga perfume i love this bottle i try not to use it a lot because i just love how it looks with the black fluid in there but it smells so unique and it's fame then i have two beyonce ones i've had these for a while but they haven't gone bad they both say heat so i don't know if there's like heat one or heat two or whatever but they both smell quite different all along here oh this is crooked so these are my victoria's secret fragrances passion struck midnight dare my favorite pure seduction such a flirt and sheer love a Britney Spears one. I went through a few of these. I love this perfume. Britney Spears Curious and I love the colors together. This was my go-to when I was a teen. This one is one from Hot Topic by War Paint Beauty and in Hyper. This smells so good. A mini Justin Bieber one and it's Someday Rose Flower. Love Me by Baby Fat. Baby Fat isn't that popular anymore so I really don't use this. I kind of just keep it as decoration honestly because I I had other baby fat perfumes and they were just so old so I gave them away and I wanted to keep this one it's called love me it's beautiful you guys remember my Demeter perfumes I had so many I oops I probably had like 20 because they are so unique like there was crayon baby powder like so many different unique scents so I started to like collect them basically and then when I was I smelt them when I was setting up my perfumes in my house and ooh, they all kind of went bad and I know like I keep some for like decoration but I just wanted to keep the ones that smelt the best for perfumes and that was brownie and vanilla ice cream so good like it's pure chocolate so I'm doing better I'm not so much of a perfume hoarder anymore here is another one of my oh time faves flower bomb by victor rolf like victor rolf like hi best perfume maker of all time again with the little vampire thing this smells oh it's, oh my god i can't even describe it like go smell it so good like it does smell like a flower bomb this wonderful charm one i think i could be wrong but i think this is a knockoff of taylor swift's like it's like a literally a dollar store version one but it smells so good like i couldn't like usually i'll just smell them for fun but this one was like stunning i could be wrong i'm pretty sure that'd be so bad if it was actually something <laughs> this one i think i got last year for christmas this is the so de la renta and it looks like that i love this bottle it's like really classic okay now the back row we have this one that i've had for ages 
kind of just for the decoration and it's Harajuku Lover's Little Angel. It smells okay. How I picture it is when I was like in high school, like gym class, like everyone had that like same body spray. That's like what this smells like. Then I have Trish's perfume. She gave this to me when I met her a few years back and it's beautiful smelling. So good. Support my girl. Then we have Juicy Couture, another one that I just look at. Like, I don't even know what's wrong with me. If you didn't know, Juicy Couture is my favorite brand name in general. Like, I love Juicy Couture. Like, it's my favorite brand. And this is the La Vida Loca, and it's just glamorous, and it smells so good, but I'm just, like, no touchy. I'm a psychopath. Here's a Justin Bieber one. I'm pretty sure this is, like, a limited edition one. Yes, because my boyfriend got this for me, and it's beautiful packaging. It smells good. There's, like, purple in there, which, of course, is him. These are both Justin Bieber girlfriends. Friend. These are my favorite perfumes that Justin Bieber has, in my opinion. I mean, I like the key, but Girlfriend is so good. And the packaging, like, come on, girl. And the mini one and the big one have different looks to them, so I like that. There's also hearts on the top. So this is basically just like a little case. Oh no wait, the other one's like a case. Cool, yeah, this one's like a case. It smells really good, like, almost like pop. Do you guys like these collection videos? Thumbs up if you like these collection videos and I can do more collection -y things. Paris Hilton, another one of my like high school jams back in the day other than Curious by Britney Spears. This is one of my like go-to, I know it's gonna be cute perfume. I always thought though for her, it's kind of just a little basic, but no shade. This little one, like look at how much I have left. Like girl, throw it away. But it's like mommy and baby is what I always say. Like mommy and baby, mommy and baby. Like I can't, like I am crazy. So I, that's why I keep them. <laughs> It smells like vanilla candy, like that in the packaging, like can you not? This beautiful guess one, it's just really girly and chic. So here's an overview of tier number two, this is all my lotions. Three Bath and Body Works ones. I have way too many lotions, like I really don't need any more, please don't send me lotions, like oh my god I have so many. This one's Hello Sunshine. Bath and Body Works and Victoria's Secret are my favorite lotions, so you're going to be seeing that a lot. Then I have Japanese Cherry Blossom, not one of my favorite scents by them, but I still like it. This is Oahu Coconut Sunset. Two um, Victoria's Secret ones. This is Passion Struck. It's Apple and Vanilla and it's oh my god so good. It smells like a pie. My favorite scent by Victoria's Secret as we all know, Pure Seduction. I can like bathe in this. Like it's so good. Body Lotion and Shimmer Gel. I love this shimmer gel. It's so sparkly. Nina gave this to me in one of our swaps and I still use it. Like it's really good. Especially when I want to be sparkly. Like if I'm going out with clubbing or something, I, that's what I reach for. Or this. This is Jergens. I know it's like basic, but I love it. It's soft shimmer and it really is. It enhances and illuminates. I don't even know if you can still buy this. Like I've kept this for so long. It's probably old, but it still makes me glow. So if you see me at the club and I'm glowing, that's what I'm wearing. <laughs> this is Forever Midnight Bath and Body Works. I don't see this anymore. So it's kind of vintage. <laughs> packaging is so cute. It's Marshmallow Pumpkin Latte Ultra Shea Body Cream. This is very moisturizing. I actually need a little bit right now. Strawberries and Champagne So Luxurious by Victoria's Secret. Passion Struck again to match that and this one is the Moisture Ultra Moisturizing. The last one back there is another one Passion Struck. <laughs> oh my god it's falling. I was sponsored by this but I really like it. That's why it's in here. It's from Booty Parlor. Yeah it's Flirty Little Secret secret firming bronzer and it really does firm and it's nice and bronzy if you can see that oh look at that shrimp girl the matching justin bieber's girlfriend lotion winter candy apple by boss and body works would be perfect right now because it is december then i have these three random ones they're by hemp's treats and i got them at winners for like 3.99 and they're so good this is orange dream cupcake vanilla cream brulee and warm apple cider warm and cozy body lotion this is a beautiful pump I'm actually I should put this in my bathroom that would be awesome and then underneath here I have the same one but it's like um just like a jar then I have this I've had this like four years this is Dior and I don't know why I keep this like I've like I'm not that bitch you know like <laughs> I don't go and buy Dior stuff. Hemp's Body Butter. I use this when my hands like need repair. I've used quite a bit of it. It doesn't smell too good, but it's really moisturizing. Then what do you know? Another Passion Struck. Passion Struck is great. Mini ones up at front. They're all Bath and Body Works. So I have two warm vanilla sugars. Then I have Malibu Heat Vanilla Teeny, Twisted Peppermint, and Paris Amour. Ooh. So here is the bottom shelf, and this is basically body sprays and mini 
little perfumes. I have a perfume stick by Lush and it's vanillary. You just like kind of roll it on. And then there's an Essence one in Candy Shop that I was sent by you guys and it's so good. Then I have a bunch of these Victoria's Secret mini ones. This is Bombshell Body Mist. Bombshells in Bloom. And then this one's a Bath and Body Works one in Amber Blush. Victoria's Secret Victoria. Noir Tees, which is the best one. Dream Angels Heavenly. This is a plastic bottle, but doesn't it look like glass? That's so cool. A little Hello Kitty stick, kind of just for decoration. Juicy Couture that I've had for like 13 million years. So it's like, old, like look how old it is, but it's Juicy Couture. So I'm a crazy, can't throw it away. This one is a Nautica one, which is almost done in Bermuda Blue. This is kind of awkward. My tripod doesn't go any lower. La Senza Beyond Sexy. Vince Camuto one, a big Victoria one. I have another Victoria one and it's a uh, shimmer lotion then back here we have another shimmer one in Be Enchanted by Bath and Body Works. Medium sized ones right in the middle. Two Beauty Rush ones. I used to collect Beauty Rush. This one's in Candy Baby. The best Beauty Rush one. That, that's why I have it twice. Candy Baby. I gave lots of these away to my friends and family. Pink, more pink body mist, which I just recently put in a favorites video. I had two. Use the other one. Oh, Secret Craving by Victoria's Secret. Another shimmer one in Warm and Cozy. Ooh, a Body Fantasies in Cotton Candy. This used to be my favorite when I worked at Value Village. I always had a mini one in my smock at work. Strawberries and Champagne, another passion straw, and a Pure Seduction, obviously. Along this wall, I have the big stand up body sprays from Bath and Body Works Mango Tango Twist, which look at the spray thing. It's like a straw. Then we have Marshmallow Pumpkin Latte. Pink chiffon, warm vanilla sugar, um, sweet cinnamon pumpkin, which is a great in a candle too, and hello sunshine. Calgon here in marshmallow? Is that what that is? Yes, marshmallow. And just a last quick overview of my collection. That is everything. I hope you guys enjoyed that video. I know it was requested and you guys love to see it. Any like collection or setups that I have. And I hope it inspires you guys to set up your stuff in a cute way. And if you do, or even if it's just like thrown in a drawer, who cares? That's you, girl. Send me a picture, tweet me a picture of it, and I would love to see them all. I hope you guys have a beautiful day and I'll talk to you guys all tomorrow. Bye, cuties.